Hello, welcome to uh, Three Quick Minutes Tuesday edition. This is day two of our 21 days of Acts 429 prayer. As you read today's study, it's really going to be about faith. It's going to be about trusting God. And as you read about it, uh, I actually talk about William Carey in it. And as you'll notice, I just happen to be wearing my William Carey University t-shirt where I graduated college from. Um, and that was totally accidental. I didn't realize I was going to be doing that. But so uh, I just wanted to, I wanted to share this with you. William Carey is well known as one of the first uh, missionaries to India. Uh, and he, he coined a phrase, and that phrase was simple. Expect great things from God. Attempt great things for God. And this, is, this statement is all about faith. It's about trusting and believing God to do what only God can do. And the question and the challenge for us as we study this and as we, as we ponder this today is do we really believe God will do great things? Or do we think that those great things in the Bible were things He used to do, but He doesn't really do those anymore? Our challenge today is to believe Him for great things. Why? Hebrews eleven six, And without faith, it is impossible to please Him. For whoever would draw near to God must believe that He exists that, uh, and that He rewards those who seek Him. Remember, we're seeking His face so that we can share His grace. And so, let's just take a few moments to pray and just to seek His face first, and we'll first do it through, through reverence. Lord, we exalt You today because of all You have done. Lord, we exalt You today because You created the heavens and the earth. We exalt You today because uh, You parted the Red Sea. You closed the mouth of lions. We, we, we exalt You and we worship You today because You sent Your Son to this earth. And we just give you worship. But also let's respond to the Lord. And so Lord, today I surrender to you. I put my trust in you because you are. Why would I put my trust in him? Lord, today I put my trust in you because you are faithful. Because you've proven yourself faithful to me, Lord. And I thank you for that. God, I put my trust in you because, because I can expect great things from you. And then begin to request, Lord, give me faith to attempt sharing the gospel with. Uh, God, open up my heart. Show me the people in my life that you want me to share the gospel with. God, help me to share the gospel with people that I see at the gym. God, help me to share the gospel. Give me a desire to attempt to share the gospel and to share my life with my neighbors. Father, and I don't have it in me to do it, so I'm asking you to do it, Lord. So God, would you, Lord, would you please today build my faith, strengthen me through the study of your word, God, give me boldness. Give us boldness. God, give us courage to share you with the world around us. To speak your truth. To speak your words. To speak your message as we should. May we not fear what people say. But God, may we boldly believe the truth of your word. And may we share your truth in love. God, we love you. And it's in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Hey, thank you so much for again joining me today. Um, I will uh, see you tomorrow. Remember, be strong in the Lord and in the strength of His might.